What have we got here, then? Here we have my grandfather's old cuckoo clock, which is in dire need of love and attention, I think. OK. Oh, wow. Oh, that's nice. It, it's a that is really clock. Nice. I mean, it, it is Victorian. And there's a bird. Is there a bird in there? Oh, absolutely. Yeah? Yeah, but it only goes cook. It only it's goes cook. It's, it's it lost its It doesn't go or it could be the other way around. I can't remember. Right, OK. It, it doesn't do the whole cuckoo. You said this was your father's. How long did your father it, it have It was this my thing? grandfather's. Your grandfather's? My grandfather's. So it was my mother's cherished, right. cherished possession. You know, I mean, you replace furniture, you replace carpets. Yeah, yeah. Cars come and go. Yeah. Everything. But that's something that's, that's consistent. And uh, my mother died in 2000. Um, and I want to be able to hand that down to my son or my daughter, whoever wants it in my family. Yeah, um, okay. It's a family heirloom. So I would just love to get it fully restored back to how it should be. So the cuckoo here looks intact, and that should work perfectly. So under its wings, we've got some stripes, which shows that there are some paintings and markings on the, on the bird. You see the, the beak opening. Usually the beak gets broken off. That's all intact. I'm just cutting off the old bellow material. I'm going to try and cut it back up to the paper. I'll then cut some new fabric. He's now giving the battered old bird its first bath for over a hundred years. Good blimey. Come out well, isn't it? Yeah. That's quite exciting, isn't it? Yeah, that is very exciting. Oh, oh, oh well. Wow. Yeah, that does look good, doesn't it? That's a treat. It really is. It looks gorgeous. Tell by the smile on your face. Yeah, no, I'm thrilled with it. I can see. That's good. You know, it looks beautiful. Now, the big test. The big test. Is the sound. I can do. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Isn't it lovely? Yeah. Now I'm getting emotional. Bless you. The whole thing just makes me think of my mum. Yeah. Uh, which is pretty sentimental. Do you know what, Ian? This gives me the greatest of pleasure to do a clock up that means so much to somebody. And to your reaction, it is just wonderful. It makes me feel really proud of what I do, actually. It was unfinished business. It was something that played on my conscience, the fact that the clock didn't work, and it's now resolved. So now that it's done, it's, it's quite a weight off of my shoulders because it's absolutely perfect. Thank you very much for repairing it and, and making it look good again.